back. We are practicing AWS together. We are doing Cloud Quest as Solutions Architect role. And now I'm going to start data ingestion methods. We need to see the problem first. Um, I'm head of data analytics at the city's shipping service. Thanks for coming. I'm happy to help. What seems to be the problem? Our package tracking application is receiving lots of streaming data. Managing the data stream without current resources is getting expensive. Our data analytics need the click stream data, but I'm concerned ab about the budget and the amount of resources required to operate effectively. Do you need to process our, your streaming data and run analytics in real time? Yes, we are aiming for that, but not an easy process for us right now. We use Amazon EC2 instance in our backend to process data and run analytics and analytics applications. Amazon Kinesis data analysis is a great way to transform and analyze streaming data in real time. We are forecasting exponential growth. Can the solution handle that? Yes, Kinesis data analytics takes care of everything required to run streaming applications and it scales automatically to match the volume and throughput of your incoming data. Using Kinesis data analytics, you can have no servers to manage, no minimum fee or setup cost. You can you pay only for resources your streaming applications consume. Now I'm intrigued. I think this could work. Can you help us manage our data using Amazon Kinesis? Yes, accept that and start the challenge. We need to see the plan first and go to the next step. This is how the architecture will look like. We are going to uh, create an Amazon Kinesis Data Firehose Delivery System, ingest and store click steam data in Amazon S3 bucket, use Amazon Kinesis Data Analytics to pre-process data with AWS Lambda, configure real-time analytics to count active page views. So after that, we are going to configure the Kinesis Data Analytics application to send real-time analytics results to an AWS Lambda function that populates an Amazon Dynamo table. So let's see the practice and start practicing. This is how it's going to look like. This last part will be the IY section. Lab console is open now. We are going to go to Kinesis. This one and create delivery stream. This is going to be direct boot. Amazon S3. Enable data transformation, enable record, enable data transformation, click browse, data processing function. This one, choose lab stack. Enable with record format. Let me see if it's going to be this one, data, data transformation. Browse and this one. Choose process data. Data. S3 bucket error. Buffer, buffer, buffer. Hints. Open this one. Choose as if existing. Service access uh, is changed a little bit. Cho choose existing IAM role, lab kinesis firehouse, this one, and then click. So this one is different. Be careful if you can't find it. Now we are going to go to EC2 console, instances, web. Shall we copy this? In a notebook, firehose of click stream data and submit. Start now. Test data set. Okay, this is testing, I guess. Go back and open Lambda. Select data processing function. Click on it. Go scroll down and see the code. Let's see the code a little bit bigger and we need to review the code 
scroll down to 49 and this is where we need to re review record event get records for the lines convert data frame okay let's go to dynamo db now let's check the tables and output table we need to check that it shows output table okay now we need to go to s3 to the buckets click on lab stack this one we need to wait until we see process data and then we go inside okay there is only one that i see click stream data and select this one and download csv let's go to kinesis from here create application legacy um, this needs to click stream data app okay and create source configure Kinets is data file, file, house, delivery stream, browse, click stream data, choose, I am row, increase the two output, do we need to do that, start, Start. Let's run all data sets. Now try that again. Okay. I save changes. Okay, now we need to go down and click on destination tab. Add destination. This was fire, fire. Mm, lambda function okay so we need to choose lambda function data processing choose choose I am row is to be Let me change that destination function row should be same up here and this one is in Kinesis as well but SQL application legacy Analytics applications, legacy, click on this one, copy IRM code, this real time analytics, okay. Configure, add this graph from Phantom, approximate distinct count. Replace. Be sure you leave the single quote around it. Crawl down to the bottom of the page. Replace current SQL.
send and run application, save and run application. Review running ready status. Wait until application is running. So this is now ready. Destination SQL output. Once we select, now we need to check if there are more running data here. I want start at all of them. In the kinesis, let's see the output. Where do we refresh it? Okay, it's changing. Configure the Kinesis data analytics application to send real time analytics result to AWS Lambda function that populates Amazon Dynamo DB table. Our servers will verify that Kinesis data analytics. Let me check if there is anything in the Dynamo DB. Tables. This one, let's see if it's going to work. Shows active and validate. Okay, now it's empty. We need to go back and um, to Kinesis SQL applications, create SQL application legacy, application name. Uh, what was application? Okay, in the Kinesis, we need to go to SQL applications, application name, SQL, let me see, application, destination, legacy, destinations. Destinations. A destination lambda function is a function that we have browse analytics destination choose okay and then specify new application stream um, destination Delivery stream, delivery stream, browse, choose I enroll, browse, oh, sorry, this one, choose. Existing. Save changes. Applications legacy. I think we need to wait a little bit and now it shows that it's um, it, I, first time when I put it it didn't work but now it's validating so it should be okay um, and I was trying to do the same thing here on the legacy and destinations lambda destination maybe this was the one that succeeded 
now I see the destinations. Okay, I will I will see you in my next video. Bye.